Welcome to the 2024-4 Schrodinger release. Let's take a quick tour through our latest innovations and improvements to the application panels and Maestro's user interface. New in 2024-4 is the full release of Glide WS, a newly enhanced molecular docking workflow that leverages water energetics from WaterMap, building upon the foundation of Glide SP and WScore. With improved scoring and ligand pose prediction, Glide WS refines hit enrichment rates and reduces false positives by filtering out compounds incompatible with target binding sites. Now fully integrated with Maestro, Glide WS provides a powerful tool for prioritizing high affinity ligands in virtual screening and lead optimization workflows. Also new is the beta release of the Mixed Solvent MD panel for identifying cryptic binding pockets. The panel allows for the setup and analysis of mixed solvent MD simulations with customizable visualizations in Maestro, providing a clearer understanding of potential binding sites on a protein surface. In the FEP Plus panel, one can now display a per residue energy decomposition plot. This helps with pinpointing the energetic contributions of specific residue ligand interactions to the overall binding free energy. For instance, in this example, where a methyl group is added to the ligand, the plot reveals that this modification decreases ligand binding affinity. This change in potency can likely be traced back to a notable reduction in the favorable interaction energy with alanine 208, suggesting a disruption or alteration in the coordination or steric fit between the ligand and this particular residue. We've also included a classification matrix in the correlation plot, providing instant insights into true positives, false positives, and more based on a set cutoff. In the IFD-MD panel, automatic sampling of histidine tautomer states is now supported, crucial for capturing dynamic changes in ligand binding as seen with histidine 407 in the PXR target. In sitemap, attempting to subdivide sites larger than a specified volume is now set by default. This option initiates a secondary, more compact analysis with tighter thresholds to differentiate between sub-pockets. This compact mode helps in preventing pocket leakage and the unintended merging of sub-pockets, fine-tuning the identification of binding sites. In the protein preparation workflow, a new Consider All Ligand States option has been added. This automatically samples and optimizes both protein and ligand tautomeric and protonation states during the H-bond optimization stage. In the biologic suite, quick access to T-cell receptor regions like CDRs and alpha-beta chains is now easier with new predefined selection sets. And the AutoQSAR panel now accepts protein descriptors, including 69 sequence-based, 54 structure-based, and 37 patch-based descriptors. As for the Maestro user interface, the project upgrade to version 5 now supports multi-letter chain names, extending beyond 26 characters. One can now customize the workspace by specifying the exact number of columns and rows for the workspace tiles. We've made the entry actions and sync options menu in plotting tools more intuitive, clearly showing when data is synchronized across charts, the project table, and the entry list. Histograms have also been upgraded to handle Boolean and string data types. And switching between histogram settings and data table views is now seamless. While in Maestro's vibrations panel, one can save animated GIFs of vibrational motion directly from Jaguar frequency calculations. These are just a few of the exciting updates in the 2024-4 Schrodinger release. For a full list of new features, visit schrodinger.com forward slash new features.